things being OTT in Britain is cigarette packets. I bloody love cigarette packets. You know the things I mean, those pictures of the tarred up lungs and just the, the mortal combat levels of gore. I think it's brilliant and we need more of it. So if there's anyone here who's working for McDonald's, right, Happy Meals on every box. It's quite simple, just one image. A stack, a pile, a mountain of dead children, kid corpses, right, with Ronald McDonald looming over in the background, spunking mayonnaise onto their fucking evaporating souls. <laughs> I'm going on Dragon's Den, by the way, this year, so fingers, fingers crossed for that. Yeah, uh, we like food in this country, don't we? Not really even much English food, it's just food from all around the world. We love food. And that, uh, that reminds me of a time uh, when my older brother, he must have, like, laced my alphabetic spaghetti with, with laxatives, because, man, talk about verbal diarrhoea. <laughs> uh, sorry about that. But my, my family on the whole, they're nice. They're, they're, they're good guys. Like, you've got my dad, he's... He's very much a stereotypical sort of father figure, and I, I don't mean that in like a manly man way, but he just, he's terrible in the kitchen, he's very much incompetent in the kitchen, and I'll explain what I mean by that. He, uh, I swear it down, he's the only man on the planet who could burn the washing up. <laughs> How the fuck is that even possible? But he's great, you know, he's very supportive of me. Uh, yeah, he's uh, always behind me every step of the way, which is really nice to know, other than when I'm in the shower. That's when the line is crossed, but cheers, Dad. Mum, on the other hand, she is, well, she's quite disinterested and, and, and cold and distant, you know? And by that I mean she's six feet underground somewhere in the middle of Norfolk. She's not dead, Mum's alive. She's a lovely woman. Sorry for that. Uh, a friend of mine, she came up to me recently and, and she said to me that her old organ teacher that she had as a kid had, had, had uh, been outed as a paedophile. That's not funny. That is inherently not funny. But sometimes I guess you just can't help but find the light in dark situations, you know? I mean, I imagine him having deliberately missed out one of those little letter stickers you get for the keys, like on a keyboard or a piano. 